If you don't have subscribed my channel, click on subscribe button below the video and also click on the bell button to get all notifications of new videos. Hey friends, you are watching Tips and Tricks Sidda and this is Zubair and today I am going to tell you that how to make this cool blurring effect with a simple photo. So to do that, firstly we have to open a new powerpoint file and now make the layout to the blank and now firstly import the photo that you want to blur. And now here is my photo and now firstly going to duplicate it by Ctrl D and again duplicate it with the same process Ctrl D and now firstly select the, any one of the photo and go to the format and here is the option remove background click on it and now firstly make this to the side so that after you can make the outer side blur and your photo will be clear and now come to the option and here you can see that mark the area to remove use that and here where you don't want mark it And if you have any problem in this marking area, you can also use the another option that was the mark area to keep. It is use what area you want to keep. And now editing has been done. So to keep these changes, come here and here is the option keep changes. Click on it. And now here you can see a photo and make it same as the back photo. And now Firstly, crop this small photo so that it will be easy to identify the bigger photos and the smaller. And now here, as we have duplicated as three times, the three photos, the first one we have cropped and the two photos are left. And in the two photos, select a one photo and now come here to artist effect in the format. And here you can see option blur. Click on it. And now the background word was blur and once again come in the format and here you can see a color option click on it and here use this saturation 33% so that the main photo will appear more clearly. Now fixing the photos and now it's time to animate them so to animate go to the animation and now firstly here click on the animation pane and here you can see an animation pane it was a good option so that you can see your animation all the animations of this slide and it tells easily that which effect we have used in this slide and now firstly click on this blur photo and here the option fade and make it after previous and delay it to the one second and its duration will be 50 seconds and now making it at the center and now it is time to show it and here you can see the photo effect and as you have seen that it was not very difficult it was very easy to do in a powerpoint so that's all for today so thank you friends